Hey guys, I'm Brickin' It and welcome back to another Lego haul. This week I've got so much stuff that I can't put it all in one box, so I'm just gonna bring it on the screen and show you what I've got and why I bought it. So, stay tuned. Okay, so this week I thought I'd do it in terms of price. So I'm gonna go from the lowest thing that I bought up to the most expensive thing, or at least what I can remember anyway. So, first things first is I got a, another one of these Ferrari sets. Now, why did I get another one, you say? Well, just because they were so cheap. Uh, these were on for like nine pounds this week on Amazon, so I just thought, why not? They're only 12 99 anyway, but I do quite like the parts and the stickers, and I just thought it was a pretty cool car, so I bought another one. I do have a review of the, I do have a review of this on the channel. So if you wanted to watch that as one of my mini build Mondays, I will link the playlist down below. Next is a load of minifigs. Now I can't remember how much these were, but these were actually from lego.com. I think they're 10.99 each, but uh, they contain four minifigs. So this one is a fun pack one, which is like, basically they're like small versions of the uh, people packs. So this one is four people. So I'll probably be doing a review of this on one of my minifig Fridays. And it does come with some exclusive stuff as well, which is pretty nice. So that's an exclusive minifigure, which is pretty cool. Here's another one, which is basically the same as the beach one, but with only small four minifigs. And he is the exclusive on this one with an exclusive parrot as well, apparently. Did not know that. Pretty cool. And then here is a cops and robbers one which I don't think anyone, oh, yep, she's also exclusive on this one. So they're pretty cool, they come with an exclusive minifig and I think they're 10.99, so they're not too bad at all. Uh, quite good for padding up the Lego City. So next we have another car, which is the Audi Speed Champions. This is a set 76897. This is the 1985 Audi Sport Quattro. Now, a lot of you guys seem to like these Speed Champions, and I got this because, it, again, it was on Amazon sale, which was £14 instead of these $17.99. So I thought I'd pick it up. It looks really, really cool. I'll be doing a review of this on my mini, uh, not Minifig Mondays, my um, Mini Build Mondays. So it, that looks pretty good, though, and it actually looks like it has two seats for a change. So I'd be interested to see how this competes with the likes of the Ferrari, which were a lot cheaper when they came out. Okay, so what's next in terms of price? It would be this one. So again, this is a usually a $24.99 set, but I got it for $19.99 at the moment. And it's obviously set 60214, and I think it's called, uh, it's Burger on Fire or something like that. I can't remember the name and they never put it on the, uh, the actual set. But it's a fire truck, which I don't have any of these, and a little burger stand, which I thought would be great to go into my city, kind of where the area is at the moment that I'm doing. Kind of a very small building, but I thought well, it was only $19.99, so I thought I'd see. And it seems like it has quite a few minifigs, I think four minifigures. So I thought, yeah, whatever, give it a chance. Hopefully it'll be pretty good. So put that over there. In fact, I'll put that underneath here with the minifigs on top. Okay, next is a set that's recently got retired from Lego. So this is on the retiring soon section of the Lego store. Um, and I was holding off on this because I wanted to get it with a promo. Um, but then it kind of completely sold out on the retired soon. So I went onto Amazon, looked straight away, and it was actually on offer. So this was $24.99 usually, but it was down to $19.99. So this could actually be a mini build Monday. You have to let me know if you want me to do this on a mini build Monday or a live stream. But it's one of the three in one creator sets. And it's kind of, it can be a little pirate ship, which is a bit weird, a little kind of uh, pirate cove, or it's this kind of treehouse play area, which I thought would go great next to the big treehouse that I have which I still need to build at some point. But I thought this would kind of go quite nicely with the camping area and it's almost like a little play area for the kids and stuff. So I thought this would be great. And for 19.99, I thought it's got some really cool parts. I love these printed pieces and stuff. So I just picked it up. Oh, and I'm throwing my minifigs everywhere. Okay, and the last thing is actually two sets, but it's actually just the same set, which is the Stormtrooper helmet. Now this, I bought two of the exact same, they're not for me, so I won't be unboxing these on the channel, but I just wanted to know your guys' thoughts actually on these. Um, I actually bought these on the May the 4th, but I didn't get the promo pack for some reason, and Lego just basically said that they'd sold out and weren't gonna send me any, which is really disappointing. Um, but yeah, really sad, because I actually ordered these on the Friday, so I don't know why I didn't get the minifig. Um, sorry, the promotion, I think it was an issue on their side, but they're not taking any responsibility for it, so. I'm just not allowed to get it, basically. But I still got double VIP points on them. But um, 
But yeah, I wasn't too bothered on these. These are actually for gifts, but I thought I'd show them off anyway. Um, but I don't know if, what your guys' opinions are, if you wanted me to do these uh, and actually un unbox them and, and do all three of them on a live stream, then let me know. Um, I think it's either all or nothing with me. I don't think I'll get, I'll either get one of them, uh, I'll either get none of them or all of them. So they, I really like the Stormtrooper the best, which is why I got it as a present. I do think it looks the coolest, although a lot of people don't like the look of it. I think it looks pretty cool. So that is it. That is my full kind of stuff that I bought this week. Quite a lot of Lego, as usual. But, um, you know, it's a Lego channel, so obviously that's what's going to be happening. So if any of you guys want me to do any of these first in the mini build Mondays or the minifig Fridays, then let me know. And if there's any of this stuff that interests you on potentially a live stream as well, just let me know as well. But we've got a couple of sets here that can definitely go into the mini build Mondays because they're under the 20 pounds which is kind of why I picked up a lot of these. Obviously, I won't do that again. But we've got one, two, three sets for that, and then three potentially for the Minifig Fridays, although these could probably be packaged together for a bigger video, maybe of doing all three at once and showing off the exclusive Minifigs. But that's it for this video, just a really, really short video. And if you like these LEGO haul videos and want me to make them more of a weekly thing, then maybe I'll start doing that and push the LEGO City update out until a Thursday. Um, because I'm going to be doing live streaming on Wednesdays as well, I think, in the future. But other than that, if you enjoyed the vid, then if you haven't already, please like and subscribe as it really helps out the channel. And as always, keep bricking it.